So, Def here, and as you guessed, uh, we are in my car again, if you can see in front. Uh, and today, what we're doing is we're putting in these footwell lights. So, I did make these myself, if you look at them closely, it's a piece of polycarbonate. Uh, I'll cut to me making them like right now, and if you don't want to watch me make them, just skip ahead from that video to whatever time I specify right here or wherever. So, we are in the lab right now, and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how I'm going to build these. So, these LEDs right here is just normal little 5mm LEDs with a flat top right here. Uh, these actually came from a string of LEDs. This is, uh, I think it's like a string of 10 LEDs from the dollar store, which were like Christmas decoration LEDs, which are powered by these two AA batteries, which is great because I get like 10 wide LED, 5mm ones, which is pretty nice. So, what I wanted to do with these was, I want to use two of them off the string of LEDs. I'm just going to use one each, and I'm going to glue them into this piece of polycarbonate. And, uh, as you should know, LEDs need a voltage drop to work correctly, unless you run the correct voltage. So, I calculated for the voltage that's going to be used in the car, which is 12 volts, and I want about... 10 milliwatts kicking out of it. So I calculated it to be around 1200 ohms and the closest I could find in my stash of stuff was this one. Yeah, brown, green, orange, which I think should come close to what I want it to do. So yeah, let's start and doing some wiring and cutting so I can get this LED in here. I'm just going to have it sunken into there just like that. Just have the wiring run around the whole thing. So let's do that. voltage to this again and see how it looks. So we got a positive here, negative over here. Mm. Got some sandpaper, 150 grit, and 
this should be able to touch the surface of this. So, you can sort of see light just emitting on my hand, which is exactly what I wanted. So, that is how you make these puddle lights, or that's how I'm making mines. So now that I'm back, um, yeah, let's uh, try to install these. So, first thing really is to figure out where to actually put these things. So, I want one in each foot well, so I'm not sure where, not even sure if you can see down there, but uh, these do run off of 12 volts. I did the math like I showed in the video for it to run off of 12 volts and have that voltage drop to give it that dim lighting that you would see in a newer car that has the foot well lighting. So let's try to figure out where I want to run the wire. There's definitely a spot to go back there. Um, yeah. So it is ran over. Uh, it goes in there, has pulled some carpeting back so I can access it. It's like running behind the heater core and the whole center console area. But it's, uh, the wires ran for it. Let's mount that thing over there. I'm probably gonna put it, like, up in this, uh, lower corner area over here. Just give the whole area some light, so, yeah. All the wiring is brought to where it's supposed to be terminated. To a point where I already tap power for something else for it, but I'm just gonna tap it in there also. So that's where it's gonna go. So all I gotta do is strip these back and wire it up and it should be good to go. So not too sure how well you can see, but yeah, wiring is done. It's just been tapped into a previous um, uh, circuit that I ran for the car. So it's all good now. So I'll just tuck it in back where it belonged. I'll show you where I actually mounted these things. So let's uh, turn on the car and turn on the lights and you should be able to see where I put them. So car's on, lights are on, so right there. It's like, well, yeah, it's kind of dark right now. You can see it's sitting right down in there. It's on. And this one is over here in this, uh, in the footwell. So, those are two spots that I put it in. Hopefully it, like, I really actually admit some... Well, it's putting off some light, as you can see. I just wanted to dimly lit the, light the, uh, footwells. Kind of like, in how a luxury car is like. Cause you know, this is luxury that I can afford. Not no bends or anything fancy like that, you know. I'm not rich or anything like that. So that's gonna have to do for this car. So, uh, try to get a night shot of it. Hopefully this camera actually picks it up and makes it actually, actually let it do its justice on what it actually looks like in person. So yeah. I will cut to night shots right now. So it's nighttime, as you can see, and uh, let's see how well these uh, these um, lights work. So, so all the lighting should be on. It's wired up to these pedals, which uh, yeah, this camera can't pick it up because it's it's really dim. The lighting is yeah. I guess the standard camera can't see it like. Uh, if I'm looking at it now, I can see it. it. Yeah, just my camera can't pick it up, so nonetheless, they do work. So, there you have it. Uh, but well, light installation on my car. Uh, yeah. The pictures and videos of the night shot, 
didn't come out as good as I thought it would be, but um, it is what it is. I don't have it that great of a camera, so yeah, the pictures and video won't do it justice. So, but it is working and it is functioning. So, yeah, that's all for this video. So, thanks for watching.